Hi, I'd like to welcome you again. Um, I haven't installed the JavaFX and NetBeans now. Let's try it's the best small program, a simple small program for JavaFX. Uh, as we all were, I remember this one, uh, to create, you have to create first of all a project. So when you create a project or start, make sure that project is a JavaFX. So I can go and click on this one. At a simple JavaFX, maybe so I get next. Now it asks you actually what's the project name, so I'm going to say process chapter 14. There it is. Uh, here, uh, by the way, it asks you where do you want to do this. So uh, by default, gives us something. So I just done uh, ADU, AD, AC, uh, multiple. Right? So I'll say it uh, with anything you want. Okay, so I'll finish this one. And this is going to create a JavaFX project for me with a default class. So this is, has been done. Uh, if you notice, now look at the projects. If I look at the projects here, go down here, and we have a look. Go to source package, and you go where that is. Is chapter 14, and you're going to have something called App Java. This. So you run this application. If you are on this application, it gives you actually a very simple uh, project. Click on run, and that's going to give you a very simple applications. However, I'm going to show you if you write your own applications, there are a couple of steps you need to do uh, before your project works. So this is very simple. That's what it says. Obviously, there's a statement here. Is enabled says hello JavaFX, which is this, this is enabled. Something you can write on. So I can click this one on this one. Uh, imagine I would like to write a project or uh, write a Java uh, class. When you do Java class, make sure you right click here, here, or where it is. I'm going to say give me Java class. So I'm going to call the class for instance. I'm going to say uh, draw circle for instance. There you go. So, finish this one. It's going to create for you. Right here it is. So, it's called those circle. The first thing you need to do, make sure this is actually, it's got a parent, it's called app, uh, application. So, I can always say extends. Or I can do so on this. On this one. There it is. So, the this one. There it is. Extends. Uh, this is called application it is. if you notice on here you're going to have a, you know, two things you're going to do uh, first of all if i click here they need to install or actually import the library uh, so the first thing it says import it so i'm going to import this one uh, this. so that's important here fine i still have this one remember this one is an apple stack so it's got a method it needs to be Implement it here. So I can click again here and it's going to tell me implement the abstract. And the abstract method is called start. So here it is. Uh, obviously, at uh, this moment in time, we're going to not talk about the, uh, the exceptions. So I'm going to take all of that away. There it is. Here. Here. So there we go. So that's what we're going to do would be the start so i'm gonna i'm gonna just say draw a circle for instance very simple program on it so i'm gonna go and say these are classes of of, of the so i'm gonna say circle at this equal a, a new circle at this so that circle we create uh, and then uh, what i'm gonna do uh, i'm gonna give the x and y place if you notice here right we need to actually import it has import the JFX of the shape so here it is uh, of the circle it is part of the shape okay uh, this one is not being installed yet uh, it's not being used yet so i'm going to say uh, i'm going to go say circle that is dot i'm going to definitely going to need two things uh, is the center x and center y so i'm going to say center as uh, i got center uh, on the circle itself if you notice on the circles here, yeah. I'm gonna uh, you need the set actually set. Um, I'm gonna say set center at this area. So I'm gonna go for x, and I'm gonna say for instance, give me a start at 200. Uh, and the same things. So I'm gonna circle the object dot set uh, 
center and I want the it is there you go y and if the let me say for instance say it tell me I'm gonna say it hundred there it is uh, so that's gonna be where part on the on the screen now what I need to do I need to set the radius for that so I'm gonna say okay circle there it is set the radius radius by with this one it asks me set the radius so uh, yes, I'm gonna say okay 75 yeah. uh, and then uh, definitely what, what I'm gonna do I'll uh, I'm gonna set radius here now I want I want the lines around it so I'm gonna say circle there it is on this one and I'm gonna say set the stroke all right there it is so here's the stroke and this it needs paint of course uh, for this one so uh, set the stroke I'm gonna say a uh, work class called color there it is dot uh, I'm gonna say color dot and that should give you actually the stroke there so I'm gonna uh, that's not the style to apologize uh, hit set so I'm gonna say I'm gonna say set set stroke set stroke there it is there it is stroke there you go so this is strokes and this is the paint so all I'm gonna say the paint is I call color uh, and dot I'm gonna the outside of it I'm gonna say black uh, so that is all right and so so go color uh, color and s um, color so it should be capitals by the way it is and Uh, if you look at this one then I can go here and if you notice here it needs to import the paint it is, so the paint is done here uh, now what I can do I can fill it with with this here so I'm going to say circle it is uh, set fill right uh, so I need to fill it fill it with paint as well so I'm going to say okay I want color dot it is the one I'm going to say for instance give me a uh, right it is. There you go. Now we've done all this. This is we've done it. Now we need to put that on on the really uh, on the stage. So the first thing you do, uh, you need to create pain. So I'm going to go and say pain. This is class get pain. And this is an object called pain equal a new pain. Definitely, I need to import that this class pain. So I just I can go in here. There it is. Yeah, it's pain. As soon as done that, all I gotta do now, uh, so I can get the children of pain. This is something it's uh, so I'm gonna say pain get children's right. There you go. So these children are uh, what is it? I want to get circle. It is all right. So this is pen. Uh, pen uh, I should uh, get children uh, yeah get children and this is actually uh, this one right uh, so do we get, get children uh, yes it is actually get children like that and I need to add to it add and I can add circle there we go yeah that's how we do it pain get children's and after the children's is the circle objects we created here all this with the, the colors and locations and, and so on so you know that uh, what we're going to do now we create create scene so I've got scene and I've got a got scene with small c uh, small s and you scene uh, there's uh, okay and now to ask for a scene of course you need to install the scenes uh, we've done sooner than that on, on the scenes remember on the scenes what you need to do on the scene the scene needs first of all you need the pane we've done that uh, and I'm going to say for instance uh, 300 by 300 give it dimensions there it is yeah having done this now uh, all, all we can do uh, uh, very very simple uh, we've done this so this is scene uh, alright this is as an object scene yeah it's uh, uh, why is this is complaining about uh, this this one's here right there you go uh, okay 
and so on. So we've got uh, uh, the scene, and we've created the uh, scene here, uh, and new scene. We've got the pane, and we've got uh, all of that right now. Now all we can do is uh, then we've got the stage, which is I create here. That's why stage here, stage, which is here. So I'm going to go say stage uh, dot, uh, and the stage here. I'm going to uh, set the title, set title. And I'm gonna call it for instance uh, string. It needs uh, a drawing circle for instance. That is okay. Uh, now uh, stage and definitely I'm gonna uh, go for and uh, do the scene. So uh, set scene at this, and I'm gonna put scene in it and head. So that's actually, if you notice, it's gone here because first complain is not being used. Uh, as soon as I do that, at this, uh, then all you do that, uh, we've done the scene, you have to show it. So I'm going to say stage, show it for me. Yeah, here it is. Now, this is all done. Now, what we need to do, we have, you know, any program, it has to have name. But the name here is different. It's uh, just a single statement here. So, public, static, void, main, main, here it is, string. We're gonna say launch launch and i'm gonna say give the arcs there it is launch as soon it comes the name launch by default we go to start let's run the program now having done this when you run the program by default it's gonna go to the application if i run this here run the application and it's gonna show you the program application not our draw circle right so if you look here it's going to give you actually the original B app file, this one. So let's have a look and see what they're going to give us. Uh, definitely, uh, and that's what it is, right? So in order to fix that, any any class you write, make sure uh, where you go, you go to your project files here. Here it is. You go to project files and click on POM XML, right? First of all, let me take, I want to take this one. Copy it, it is here that tells you actually which program the project should run. Then this one where it says main, that's main class. Look at this one here, main class. It says if you want the pro project, it has to go through a uh, run up. Now we've got the circle, I can put circles here, right? Here it is. Uh, if you close this one, so it will ask you to save it. So I'm going to save it, okay? Or you click on here, you save it. Here it is. Now run the program. And that should actually pick this one for us uh, to draw. Right. And we say, it, I say, it said radius here, 75, and the black outside and red, uh, it filled with red, where it's red color. Right. Here it is. So I can, I can, uh, I can make the size as well. You can mix with the size as well uh, as we go along. Here it is. So here's a circle. Right, started here and here, obviously, because I will draw long uh, way. So I can probably put it here 100, uh, and this one 100 is going to be actually uh, near five headers. So that's 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 simply uh, how do the FX classes. It's very simple. Uh, I'm going to show this, yeah, okay. Uh, this one make it smaller. Right, uh, the the one we clicked on. Uh, to apologize, I clicked on the uh, on the scene. Right, uh, the sh the one should be actually I'm gonna say 600 uh, by 600. Here it is. Uh, the one we're only aiming at the center. Yes, center. I'm gonna center say 100, uh, and this one center is. Uh, I'm gonna make it uh, 100 as well. But let me do this one. That's ah, fine. So I've got this one. This one we need to check. No, on the scenes, the now the screen is big. Uh, it's gonna come because I give it 600. 600 here yeah, is gonna be a big one. The, si the size of, of the scene. And we look at this one here. It is. We wait for it. It uh, should comes out uh, any any moment. It's, it does actually because the effects takes a bit longer time. Here it is. So here, that's why. We have it here. 
we move it actually and drop and uh, x and y by the way start at this point right well this is actually what's uh, you know it's a very simple uh, fx uh, program uh, in net gains or in jam thank you so much if you have any questions please don't hesitate to uh, to contact me and you can subscribe to to my channel thank you thank you so much thank you